in this tutorial I want to tell you a difference between using textures and using materials in UDK. This is something that I had a lot of confusion about when I first started. I thought that when I'm texturing my environment I was supposed to use textures. But there is a fundamental difference in using textures and materials. So let's open up the content browser and I'm going to filter by textures and I'm going to click on all assets so we get to see all of the textures. A texture is a 2D static image that was created in an outside application such as Photoshop or GIMP and then imported into UDK. This is often comes in a form of a diffuse map, a normal map, or a specular map. And you will see all of the textures in UDK have a slight red outline and texture 2D name at the top. The slight red outline means that we cannot use this in the level. If we left click and drag, we cannot apply that texture to our static meshes or to our BSP brushes. So in order for these textures to work and for us to use them, they have to be part of a material. So if we filter by materials, and uncheck textures. Let's use this ceramic wall as an example. This is a material that was created inside UDK and it has textures as part of that material. If we double click on the material we open a material editor and then here we have texture samples which are an expression that contain the texture that we imported into UDK. So in this case this is a diffuse. Let me bring up the properties box. Here's a diffuse texture. Here we have a specular map. And here we have a normal map. So all these textures were created in an exterior application such as Photoshop or baked. In this case, if it's a normal map, it might have been baked in a 3D application or maybe using Crazy Bump or X Normals. And then they were saved as a static 2D image and imported into UDK. Then in UDK you create a new material and then you use those textures as part of the material to get the final effect that you see here and the one that we can actually use in the level. So if we grab a material and we left click and drag right onto a BSP brush, we can apply it. We can also apply it to our static meshes. And that is the main difference between textures and materials in UDK.